Hey, it's dude. Shh. We're looking for deer. I think they're around here. Shh. You come crew with us too. Why don't stay as crew? We are. Shut up. Shh. We're looking for deer. Oh, almost fell on stick. This is a, uh, oh no, it's a squirrel, right there on that tree. This is our woods. And I don't mean just Indiana woods, this is our woods. There's just so many dead leaves. Or you, just, you hear the crunch. Oh, are they over there? So there are deer that were off that way. I don't know if they're going to come around this way or if they already did. They saw us that way. Sorry, I'm talking too loud. Sorry. Maybe they went to the water. Right here, we're gonna build a cabin. That's why this tarp is right here. And we're going to, what? Huh? Oh, it's probably a squirrel. Cause if it was a deer, you'd hear it, or you'd see it. But right here, we're gonna build a cabin. Like I said, that's why that tarp is right there. And I think, we might build it facing that way. And then later on, I don't know how much later on, but we're gonna build another one right there, another cabin. Right that way. Shh. Well, there's no way around it. I don't know where they went. Pretty sure they're over there by the pond. We could walk that way, yeah, walk that way. The only thing is walking this way, you have to watch out because some of these plants have thorns. You'll get stuck. Jason's freaking out because I stepped on the stick and it hit his leg. You gotta watch out for the jumping sticks, dude. They bite. You, sticks, you watch out. sticks bite around here. You can see the pond from here. So deer walk this way through the dried up creek. They come up and down this area. Up, oh, see, I got caught. Get off of me. Oh look, a tennis ball. Well, let's not slip. See, thorns. Yeah, we're not gonna go through that because there's a lot of dangling this way. I should have brought a dilly to cut. I think we're gonna go back up right here. Oh, you found a freaking staff, dude. It looks like a uh, Gandalf. I'm hearing a lot of rustling over there. I don't know how these deer do it. Cause there's a lot of, yeah, I told you, that looks crazy. Cause there's a lot of these thorny plants and stuff and they just walk around like nothing. They're built different. Maybe right here they've been walking. Nope. I will say, I don't know if we're gonna see any deer. They're probably already long gone. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is gonna look all crazy when there's snow.
the turtles were released out this way. Well, at least they're not thorny. Mm. This right here. So, just kind of, what the heck are those? These. There it is. You got a bunch of little dillies on my leg. I think this might end here because thorn right there. But there's the pond. Maybe back this way. There's thorns right there. I don't want to oh, walk that way. Maybe never mind. Maybe we'll go back the other way. Ah, yep, I'm getting thorned. Ah, my butt. <laughs> well, we didn't see the deer. Watch, they're probably back up there. I'm hearing a bunch of sounds everywhere, but there's a bunch of squirrels around here. Well, we tried. There'll be many chances to show you. Adventure fail. No adventure is a fail when we're hanging out with you. Hello, dear. Hi. He sees us. Just deer in the front yard. <laughs> That's weird. They saw us. Oh, did they? Yeah. Oh, there they are. <laughs> That's awesome. Mm -hmm. And just like that, we went from woods to this replay. Jason's trying to look for a game, so let's look for that game. I'm gonna find your face. And then we'll see if I find something. You know what though? Maybe we could find a Christmas story because this is a good one though, right here. The Santa Claus. Santa Claus is a classic that I really like. Um, why not get this one, I don't know how much it is. All unmarked DVD movies are two dollars. Get out of here, dude. Two dollars for this, and it's a special edition. Yeah, there's the Polar Express. The Polar Express is a good one. That's a real good one right there. Am I saying that right? Sea World. Sea World game. Kind of just want to get it just because. <laughs> yeah. Come on, it's Sea World. I think I might. All right, well, I guess these are the ones we're gonna get. No Christmas story. I couldn't remember what I was gonna say right there. Uh, it says the unmarked movies are two bucks, so. South Park game. So these all right here, Christmas movies should be two bucks, I believe. All right, for less than 12 bucks, 11.76. Six DVDs and one game. That's pretty crazy. I promise crew, this is not a repeat adventure. Why do I say that? Because on another adventure we went to replay and then we came here and then maybe we went to Walmart and I think we're gonna go to Walmart after this too. I think so. Don't copyright me. They have really cool pins in here. There are patches everywhere along the windows and pictures of soldiers, policemen, veterans. So we got brisket, uh, but we got lean. It looks like a lot of fat on my brisket. I know there's people that like that. I do not. I also got pulled pork. Cornbread comes with it. Yes, yeah, I got mac and cheese. But you still got a good amount of meat on yours. On mine, that's just like almost half. Still, my favorite one, Smoky Mountain, followed pretty close by Chicago Sweet. How's that? He's not even listening to me. Huh? Huh? Say, so how's that? Yeah. Um, yep. You know what's not? I don't. The fat? Why does something chew the fat? He's a little more country yes. than that. This gelatin. All I know is you see is a rising, 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 a rising,
He's a little more country than that. If you knew the song, you'd know that part. Chewing the fat. We don't chew the fat here. Pretty good? Good. Mission Barbecue is always good. Pretty sure they gave us moist instead of lean. Still good though. So we have to get winter stuff because... Who left the burrito here? I don't know who left the burrito. What the heck? Because although... Yes, we're wearing sweats. I guess I didn't show you. But these are uh, more California sweats than like Indiana sweats. Hey, what the heck, pumpkin? Yeah, we also need snow boots. I don't know where the heck those are. Are these snow boots? These are dairy boots. Thermal inserts. Insole. Insole. There's a lot of stuff you gotta buy when you're not used to this cold weather that's happening, right? Yeah. Fulu. Fulu shoes. I'm trying to say, I already said it, but yeah, there's a lot of stuff you gotta buy when you're not used to this coldness. Not bad. Waterproof. Snow boot type dilly. 50 bucks. Hey, look, right there. Yeah, those are pretty good. Up to minus 5 degrees. And you might think, eh, you don't need a minus 5. Um, yes, it gets in the negatives here. <laughs> it gets insane. Here's some crampons, which are pretty cool. Yeah, they have to stretch. The thing is, I've never seen crampons like this. And the cool thing about these, actually, we've had different kind crampons. The chain one with the teeth, and what happens with those... those will get dull. No, well, when you... It builds up snow, you know? So after a while, you have to, like, kick your boot for it for the snow to fall off because it just gets all stuck in there. These, you wouldn't have that problem. That's pretty good. So looking for a Christmas story. They have a Christmas movie right there, I guess. Never been a uh, Christmas there. Nope. These are games. No one games. All right, well, no Christmas story, but this is gonna do it for this adventure. Thank you so much for hanging out with us on this one. I don't know what I was gonna say right there, but yeah, thanks for hanging out with us. You hanging out with something you never ever have to do on purpose or back. And we appreciate all of you. This is probably another short one, but I will find any excuse. I don't know what you were doing right there, but I'll find any excuse to hang out with you because uh, that's what we love doing. You're all awesome. Thanks for coming. Thanks for venturing. I'm gonna throw Sorry. this phone at your face. You know what? Give me the phone. Promise crew. Hold on, wait, hold on. Unless you live here, unless you don't live here. Well, I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about.